Well, I know some people will be happy to see I've got my auxiliary tank out, and this will be a concourse video. Uh, what I did was I took a piece of paper and cut it kind of the flat area of my sergeant seat, and then I mirrored that and come up with this little thing here. And I don't think I'm going to go in quite that far, but it's kind of peaked right here, and I don't want to have an edge on that peak because that's where the seat's going to get cut. So what I'm probably going to end up doing is radiusing this out a little bit more right here. It won't come down to a point, so it looks like a, a rounded off heart. Uh, and then I'm going to transfer this into sheet metal, or probably plate more likely, so it's tough. And I figured out with the valve on the left side, I need a four inch, four inch lift so that I can operate the, the valve handle and it clears everything. So that's what I'm going to do. And I'm also going to try and get brackets prototyped for uh, underneath this because the ones it comes with are just shit. They're all bent up. I don't like them and I'm probably not going to keep that cover on it. But uh, yeah, that's just a quick update on the fuel cell. I'll probably have another video by the end of the week. Well, I got my drafting tools out and I ended up with a template like this and I'm gonna pop some holes in it to make it lighter. But uh, it's actually a little bit bigger than the tank is. And the reason for that is I'm gonna put uh, eighth inch by one inch flat metal in here to create a, a flatter surface so I don't just have the eighth of an inch on the edge on this tank. Then I'm also going to put some uh, rubber of some sort on that one inch strap to cushion it a little bit. Uh, I'll have a little bit of a tab coming over this way so that I can bolt a strap around the top of the tank and that's what's going to hold it in. And my other uh, template right here uh, it's formed kind of like the seating surface on the back of my bike. And I'll weld one of these on each side and brace it. And then um, that's just going to be a plate. I don't know if I'm going to put anything under it. I might just put a rubber hose around the edge to keep the sharp edges off the seat. And then I'm going to have to figure out, once I have that done, some way to mount it. But I've got a few ideas in my head. I'm just going to have to throw away some metal on uh broken dreams and wasted time to get the the mounting system for this right but uh, that's where i'm at on the fuel cell project so far